Hello, this is Michael Beatman with your Gateway FS Weekly Wrap-Up for Friday, September 8th. Uh, we had a really quiet tra uh, trading week on the Chicago Board of Trade. Uh, December corn was up two and a quarter cents. December wheat only closed up a quarter cent. Pretty narrow range on the December wheat contract this week. And then uh, November beans, we were looking at uh, it closed down uh, six and a quarter cents on the week. So pretty quiet across the board. Everybody's looking ahead to next week, September 12th at 11 o'clock. Our time is uh, the USDA report. Um, hearing calls for a couple bushel reduction in the corn yield, maybe down to 173 and, and being yield to pretty much stay steady at 50 bushel per acre. Um, that's, what, that's what we're seeing. The, as far as um, harvest activity, the, the South is having a pretty decent harvest, um, but the river is not cooperating again this year. So we're starting out kind of the way we did last year with reduced drafts. We're at nine foot on the Mississippi River right now, and there are calls for it to go to eight and a half. If memory serves, we did not go to eight and a half, and if we did last year, we weren't there for very long. Again, that, that just means that um, you, you can't put as many bushels on a barge. So if demand was good, we would be demanding a lot of barges and we would be seeing a higher barge freight, but with our, with our lack of exports, there's not a lot of demand for barges and, and you're seeing a pretty average harvest number right now. And, and, and to couple that, we, we haven't seen basis fall out of bed yet like we did last year. Um, last year with the demand and record high barge freight, we had, we had really bad basis numbers and really big carries into January last year on both corn and beans. And so we're not, we're not necessarily seeing that shape up yet. Um, again, most of this is due to the lack of export demand. So uh, we're here um, looking forward to next week's USDA report and see if that can move the markets, um, hopefully in the right direction, hopefully up. Like I say, um, looking for corn yield to go down and then hopefully for some decent export numbers. We would, we would like to see some export demand uh, in both corn and beans. As always, if you have any questions, please feel free to give myself, Adam Parker, or Phil Sally a call at 282-4000. Thank you.